Hey, yo, what's up, gamers? Welcome back to another video. It's me again, Blue Totella, and this is Tower Vlog 30. That is so cool. I can't believe we're already up to Tower Vlog 30. Like, oh my god. Um, I forgot when the last time I posted a Tower Vlog was. It was probably only a couple of days ago, but that's all right because this I I have a lot to inform you guys on. Um. Basic. Oh yeah, where was? Oh yeah, that's right. My soda tab bag. First off, look, I've got five rows of it completed. That's five ninths of the way there. And also, I've I've come up with a better plan for this for it to be complete. Because you see, I thrifted this strap for one dollar, right? But that was old news. Um. Anyway, so once I've gotten my nine rows finished, right? I'm gonna. I got this piece of fabric. Actually, no. I'm going to fill in the sides, right, and then I'm going to crochet a lot at the top so it can be, like, uh, it has, so it will have a thicker top and it will look neater as opposed to just the soda tab crochet thing. Um, and then I'm going to um, sew this bit onto the inside like, like that so that the bag can have a proper looking inside. Um, and it'll be, it'll be good on, it, it'll be like that. That's a horrible representation, but you guys get what I mean, right? And perhaps I can put a zipper on it, I don't know, I have like a bajillion zippers, I need to use them. But, um, not to say that I'm trying to use up my zippers, it's just that I like bags with zippers. Especially if this bag is going to be like my new favourite bag. But like, I mean, I, I love this bag that I usually use, right? But I need another bag. Well, actually, I don't. But I like bags, and they look cool, so you know. Also, tomorrow I am going shopping, and I cannot decide on what shirt to wear. I have got three shirt shirt options, and I need to, and I need you guys to help me choose. I mean, my I schedule my videos, so by the time this is up, I'll probably already have chosen something. But I still want your guys' opinion. So I was thinking I could wear like this shirt because like this is one of my favorites. Um, I thrifted it a few days ago, or a few weeks ago. It's this, um, how do you pronounce that? Sui V brand. It looks like that. It's very cute. I like the neckline on it because it actually goes down quite a bit, which I think is epic. And it's really comfy, especially if it's like cold outside or whatever, because it's, it's, it's quite warm, right? But then, there's also, um, I think I was telling you guys about this shirt in another video. Hold on, let me just fix up the sleeves real quick. Why are my shirts always, like, messed up? I swear, I do fold my clothing. Well, I try to fold my clothing, but it always ends up getting messy. Um, this shirt, this is, it's pretty epic. Um, what brand is it? It's, uh, Spirit Size M. I mean, it's it's quite large, you know, size M, but it still fits me surprisingly. I like this shirt because, look, it has buttons and a collar. Like, look at these buttons on it. I love it, and it has a collar. I don't usually wear collared shirts. Well, I mean, my school uniform has a collar, but most of my shirts don't have collars. And I really like this shirt. It's also very comfy. It's like this one, but the stripes are thinner, and it has a collar and the buttons. Um... I wore this one last week, but I love it so much, and it's so comfy, and it's warm. Um, but then, there was a shirt that I bought, like, um, just last Saturday, and I haven't worn it yet. Well, actually, no, you say I, I wore it today as I went roller skating. But I'd love to wear it out in public. It's, it's, um, it's this urban brand, and I love this shirt. It, it's actually so cute, right? Um... Yes, it is kind of, um, it, if it's cold outside, it's probably not best to wear a t-shirt, but it looks like this. It's so cute. Um, it's 3XX, um, for, made for eight-year-olds. Um, I can fit it surprisingly. It fits me perfectly. One of the rare shirts that actually fits me. Um, and I, I like it because, like, look how cute that neckline, like, it's kind of, um, gathered a bit. Same thing with the sleeves, and like, I love the sleeve length, um, it's nice, and I just, I think that it's so- 
Um, I think that it's like it's so nice and I'd love to wear it because like I haven't worn it out yet. But what if it's freezing? But that's alright because last Saturday I also thrifted, I think I was telling you guys about this, but this really cute fur coat. Um, I love it and I need to wear it out. Um, and then of course with my little pants. So what shirt do you guys think I should wear? Um, help me decide in the comments down below. Oh yeah, there was also another thing I wanted to tell you guys about. Because, like, you see, I had a spectacular day today. Um, what's it called? Uh, because I got money. Like, a lot of money. Um, because I was doing some art thing. I signed up to do this art thing at the start of the term for, like, the senior group that was doing this business project for, like, um, market day. And basically all I needed to do was, like, draw up some art for them. And then they would sell it. And today I finally got the money back. They paid me 25 bucks. Like, oh my god. So thank you so much to those guys. I appreciate it. I love money. Um, because if I have money, then I can buy myself stuff. And that's cool. Um, and I can actually say that I earned it. Because, you know, I, I made art. I got money in return. Um... What's it called? So that's really cool. And also today was an epic day because because um I got my grades back. I got my grades back and my grades are like I got like 11 ones and that is like the best. I only got three fours. I mean wait no I only got four threes which is, threes are average grades, but then the rest of them were twos. Um, and I know that I've said this a bajillion times before, but ones are the best, twos are great, and threes are average, fours and fives are like horrible. So like, I do not have any horrible grades, and like it's only term two, and I already have 11 ones. Like, oh my god, I am doing amazingly. Um, and also, in my fashion class, you know how I was telling you guys about how I made those really cute basket thingies? Well, yes, I, I told my fashion teacher about them, and she really liked them. I taught her how to make them, and she taught the class, and we did that today, and that was epic. Um, I made another bag. It's, it's over. It's, it's over. It's too far out of my reach. I would show it to you guys, but basically it just looks like a normal basket except as stripes on it and it's like brown beige it's epic um also another thing i learned how to use a printer well i mean i know how to use a printer but like my school printer i've never used a school printer before um i i have once but not in my like my home computer because, like, you can, like, put your home computer to the printer. And I did that today. And I printed out my newspaper article for, for my social studies project. And my social studies teacher, she really, 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 really liked it. Which I'm happy about. And also, in English class, right, um, we had to make these, like, haiku poems or something for, like, the nine stars of Maturiki, you know, since it's Maturiki week next week in New Zealand. We're learning about that at school. Um, we learn about it every year. Um, but we had to make nine poems. I was the first one to finish. And I walked up to my teacher, Mr. Lada, and I showed him, and he read my, um, haiku poems, and he really, really, really liked it. I think that he likes my writing, and that makes me happy, because he is my favorite teacher. Um, and then he told me that, like, he gave me this other worksheet thingy to do. Well, it wasn't really a worksheet, it just, it was a paper with, like, four different stars on it. And he said that I need to choose my four favorite poems that I wrote and write them down inside of the stars um and then color them in and like i noticed that in english class whenever i'm given an assignment i need 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 to do my bestest bestest work yet not to say that i don't do my best in my other classes but just i put a lot of extra time and consideration into my work in english class because i want to impress mr ladder because he's my favorite teacher i want him to think that i'm a good student um and so I chose my four best poems and I spent ages 
doing my bestest handwriting and then I colored them in but like I wasn't sure what he meant by actually like coloring them in whether I just color them in it with a basic color or like do patterns and designs and stuff and so I did some pretty cool designs that like reflected onto what like all of the different stars represent right um and I spent ages doing that and then like the bell was about to ring so we had to hand them in a pile like put all of like all of everyone in class we had to put our work into a pile and I put mine in the pile and as I was putting it into the pile I noticed that I was the only one that did the designs and stuff and it, it clicked in my brain that I probably shouldn't have done the designs because these are supposed to be stars and I'm pretty sure they're supposed to go on the wall and they're supposed to look like stars not have designs on them because it's supposed to focus more on the poem not the cool designs but I'm really happy with how it looks and my artwork is beautiful but it's it's not supposed to be art it's supposed to be poems and stars um, I mean technically I did put the poem and the stars on it it's just with a bunch of cool designs on it um, but I don't know I, I yeah Sometimes putting your- I mean, I, I haven't checked with Mr. Letty yet, so I'm not sure if what I did was a good thing or a horrible thing and I need to restart. Very hesitant about that, but that's alright. Because tomorrow is going to be a fun day and I'm going to forget all about it. Um, I'll save that till Monday's problem. For Monday's problem. Um, make sure to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you get all the latest updates. Bye-bye.